The fall edition of the Tupelo Furniture Market gets underway today, and they're already handing out some of the hardware. Yeah, this year's Buyer of the Year Award is coming up. WCBI's Allie Martin is live at the market with the latest. Allie? We are here in Building 6 of the Tupelo Furniture Market. The Buyer's Award is going on right now, and joining us now to talk about the Tupelo Furniture Market and the furniture industry is Mike Armour with ARC. Mike, thank you so much for being with us. Tell us, furniture is still a huge part of the economy here in North Mississippi, isn't it? A great market this, this time, a lot of good traffic from all of our people. Again, the furniture industry employs over 20,000 local people. Uh, again, the local folks have had a good, good traffic through their stores. We're honored to have... Uh, We've got uh, Glenn McCullough here. We've got Tate Reeves here, mm -hmm. Lieutenant Governor. And uh, they're doing a tour with Senator McMahon, going to some different places. They went to the Elvis birthplace and they're touring some industrial sites. Well, the state of Mississippi put money into the Elvis birthplace this year. Through Bonnie Elvis is big. Elvis is big. <laughs> number one uh, in the state of Mississippi, yeah. number one tourist attraction. But uh, we're honored to have them here tonight. VM Cleveland and his staff done a phenomenal job. And again, good traffic. They're on the stage now, and they should be off shortly. But. Uh, we're uh, glad to be here. That's right. They'll be at some sites tomorrow too. They're they're making some some tours tomorrow around in the in the region. Mm -hmm. They there sure are. So. All right. Thank you so much, Mike. As we said, the Buyers Award ceremony is going on right now. We're going to have a full recap coming up at ten. For now, we're in Tupelo. We'll send it back to you in the studio.